Hello, thanks for dropping by. I'm Moodscape, you can call me Mood, and I'll be here to document my gameplay for Minecraft 1.18. I'll be playing Bedrock Edition on mobile. Okay, here we are, at spawn. Hmm, guess we'll get some trees. So anyways, this is actually not my first time trying to record a gameplay. I did one for 1.17 and it lasted a whopping three episodes. <laughs> Life happens, other priorities took over, and I had to put it on hold. Yeah, no, my dog died, then I didn't recover from that. <clears throat> So for this series, I think it'll be pretty fun if we could do something underground. We've got these huge 1.18 cave generations, and I really want to build and explore that. So yeah. Okay, first tool. My trusty pickaxe. There. Oh, food! I mean... You saw nothing. What have we here? Ooh, look at that. Oh, so dangerous. So very dangerous. I'm gonna live here. <laughs> Let's get some stone. And maybe I'll turn this into some kind of temporary base. It's night time now. I didn't find any sheep, so I have no beds. <laughs> but now I'm bored. Let's go kill some spiders. Good thing is, the string that they drop can also make wool. Daytime! Great! Okay, here we are. We have a bed now. But I want to get out of here and go deeper into the caves and stuff. And let's go. So down here looks pretty dangerous. So I think we'll explore a bit. Maybe there's another safer cave entrance somewhere else. Nope. Wow. <laughs> How do I even get there? And that's just a hole. Hmm? Wow. What's this? Let's take a closer look. Wow. Oh, look at that. Look at the view. Oh my gosh! Oh! Wow! Look at that! That is so pretty! I wanna live there! How? How do I get there? Ah! No! <laughs> That's one way to get there. We're starting over. <laughs> yes, I'm still looking for a decent cave entrance. Oh, what about here? This looks safe. Boop! Come on, trusty flower, get me to safety. Bruh. Shoo! Oh, come on, again? Shoot, shoot! Oh. Oh! How many of you? Wow. Nope. Nope, 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 nope! There. No! No! What? Ah, no! Oh no! 
help. Oh, what do I do? I'm so dead. Oh, there it is. I'm alive. I'm alive. <laughs> I'm Never mind. Boop. You know what? I'm gonna turn this place into a base. Well, another temporary base. Despite how it looks, it's actually pretty close to the exit. I know, I've been pretty nomadic so far going from one base to another, but it's because once I choose a home, I'm likely to be there for the rest of the series, so you know, gotta take my time to find the right spot. So while we're at it, we'll light up the caves and mine for more resources. This is where I want to live. I mean, look at it. Ow. Bruh. Come on. Is that... First diamonds, yay! Hmm? Is that it? Anymore? No? Yay! Ooh, more! Yes, yes, gimme, gimme! This should be enough to make myself a pickaxe, mine some obsidian, make a portal, and head to the nether. Let's go! Give me a good spawn. Give me a good spawn. Oh no, this is not a good spawn. Alright, quick, we gotta box this up. We gotta make it safe from any of those... Those guys! Okay, we're all boxed up and safe. I need to take a quick look around just to get to know this area a bit better. Yikes. Nope. No. Hmm. There is nothing here but soul sand and lava. Come on, give me something. There! We have a crimson forest. Perfect. Now we need to make our way there somehow. But first, safety! Phew. I hate this place. Ah! Come on! So what I want to do is dig down to roughly Y level 15 and just make a tunnel towards the Crimson Forest. That seems like the safest option. Okay, letters are made. Let's make our way down.
Oh. Oh. This is not gonna work. I mean, I could use sand and gravel, but I don't have enough right now. Fine. Let's do it the hard way. Nope, not that way. Wait, which way again? Ah, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Uh, let's just get to safety first. In here, quick. We're here. Oh, hello. Oops, forgot to work all BRB. So I came to the nether looking for some stem, shroom lights, and quartz. So let's just get some of these and get out of here. Yay! Back all safe and sound. I've got some resources and I'll be using this for my future starter base. You'll see. Follow me. I want to show you something. So in between recording, I light up these caves off camera. And in one of my sessions, I actually found a spot I want to settle down in. Kind of regret not filming at the time. So anyways, let me show you. Ow. And let's go. Away from these mobs and up this water stream. Almost there. Okay, here we are. So this platform here is where I'm gonna settle down. It's got all the space to build farms and stuff. And best of all, the view is fantastic. Look at that. Next up, we're gonna connect the new home area to the outside of the cave. The exit's right over there. You can see where I'm currently based. It's down there, just by those farms. So anyways, if I'm not mistaken, anywhere above by level 30 should be fine. Okay slimes, I gotta make this bridge. Please don't push me off. Thanks. Alright, here we are. We have a safe passage to this platform now. So I guess that means I'm ready to move up. So I've moved most of my stuff up here. And this time, we're gonna finally build my starter house. In my chest earlier, I had deep slate, andesite, stone, and crimson stem. Those will serve as the base materials for this build. As for the location, I'm thinking somewhere around here. There's a potential to build a bridge towards the center of the cave. If that's what I need in the future. I'm not sure yet. So, I realized I haven't mentioned much of my plans this series. I wanna go cyberpunk. Why? Maybe cause I'm just in the mood for it. <laughs> I'm thinking an underground cyberpunk city kind of vibe would be really fun to explore. And I'd love to give this build style a shot. So, let's build the starter home first.
look! The facade is pretty much done here. On the inside, we have a basic structure going on. The bedroom is gonna be here. And we've got stairs leading down here to the storage room. We have another exit leading back outside. It looks pretty rough now, so yeah, let's clean this all up. Almost there. Ooh, I like this. This will do. setup is done. The real setup is down here. Above is just for aesthetics. As you can see, we don't have enough levels yet, so we'll handle it next episode. One last thing to work on is the bedroom. We're gonna make this place a little bit cozier. Well, in a dystopian cyberpunk kind of way. Alright, this is it. We just need some final touches. Some flowers would be nice. Boop! Boop! Of course, no home is complete without some cheesy, heartwarming message. Live, love, love. <laughs> there. Alright, we're done. Let's take a quick tour. Come out here, this is what it looks like from the outside. And we'll go down this platform where we have <gasps> where we have some graffiti art here. If we go down this hidden passage, you'll end up back in my storage room. We've got the enchanter there and an indoor staircase leading back up here, where I do most of my smelting. Oops, struggling to control this camera. And my cozy little room to my right here. So if you made it this far, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you again next episode. Bye!